What's up guys, it's Skirts here, and today we're going to be doing another, uh, yeah, Pokemon Break Bonds video. <laughs> hey, what is up everybody, I'm Star Lord, and today we're going to be taking another look at a huge update that is going to be coming to Pokemon Brick Bronze very soon and this update is absolutely amazing. Honestly, I would never have called it. I never knew that they were going to add this in. So this kind of new implementation feature kind of thing is very, very cool. Uh, but before we get into the update and the video itself guys, don't forget to leave a like as it does help me out and uh, you know, it just kind of shows your support for the channel. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel guys, don't forget to smack the subscribe button and turn on notifications so that you never miss a Pokemon Brick Bronze video. Um, okay, so getting into it right now guys, um, last night I was looking at Twitter in bed, as you do when you're tired, you're kind of just scrolling through with everything, laughing at the memes, and uh, yeah, I saw that uh, one of the Pokemon Brick Bronze developers actually retweeted another Pokemon Brick Bronze developer, and it was something very, very interesting, and I'm going to show you it on screen right now. So as you can see, the developer that originally tweeted this was Shypool. He is a Pokemon Brick Bronze developer, and he put a little something, uh, a little something something, a Bobby Katzen, and I have been working on for the update. And what he means by update is actually the next update that is coming out, which is the uh, Port Deca update. And if we just play this video really quickly, you will see that it is animated. And uh, yes, that is right, guys. They are actually different skinned Gyaradoses and Magikarp. So one is kind of like a red one with a pattern, and the other one is kind of, I don't know whether it's a dark blue, or maybe it's just kind of a purpley kind of color. I'll let you guys decide in the comment section below, but either way, that is amazing. Now, before you guys go out and flip and everything like that, these are not auras, okay? So, you know the way Pokemon Brick Bronze did, like, aura Pokemon, and Pokemon could look, like, blue and green and blah, blah, blah? Um, no, this is actually nothing to do with that in a certain sense. Uh, this is actually celebrating Magikarp Jump. Now, a lot of you guys know that around about a month or two ago, Magikarp Jump came out on the Android and the iPhone, and it was pretty big, you know, a lot of people really liked it, and it showed off a couple of new skins for Magikarps in the game, and weirdly enough, Shypool and whoever else has uh, been working on this has actually decided to add them into Pokemon Brick Bronze. So, when we're actually going about uh, kind of fishing and everything, that Magikarp won't be the only Magikarp we can find, you know, it won't be just a normal Magikarp or a shiny Magikarp, this will be a whole set of Magikarp colors and patterns that you will now be able to get in the game. And uh, yeah, I'm going to show you guys right now, uh, as we scroll down, uh, Lando actually says that there are going to be 28 vari variations? Var variations? What does that even mean? Uh, 28 varieties of patterns that you can find on Magikarp coming into the, uh, you know, the update. And then he said that there's going to be more over time. And uh, when somebody asked Shypool, uh, you know, like, are these auras? He said, no, they're just for Magikarp and Gyarados due to the whole, you know, Magikarp jump uh, game that they released uh, a couple of months back. And that's pretty awesome, right? Now, what I decided to do whilst I was kind of just sat in bed was like, I was like, well, wait, I've only ever seen, like, two patterns of Magikarp Jump, so where are the other ones? So I decided to actually go and find them for you guys, and we're going to be taking a little dive and look at them right now in the actual video itself. And uh, starting with this one right here, this Magikarp is called the Apricot Striped Magikarp. Now, unfortunately, I don't have any of the Gyarados pictures, so maybe Gyarados may look extremely different. Uh, but yeah, this is one of the patterns that we will find on the Magikarp. Now, it is still unknown whether we will see these patterns in the game. 
because, you know, maybe they just decide to make their own patterns or something. Uh, but either way, I'm pretty happy. Uh, but we're still going to go over the official Magikarp jump patterns because you never know, they might actually get into the game. Uh, so this one is the Apricot Stripes. The second one right here is the Apricot Tiger, which is a very awesome one indeed. I love those little, like, kind of spiky stripes. Um, then we move on to the Apricot Zebra. Not really a fan of that one, to be honest. Then we move on to the Brown Striped. And, uh, yeah, the Magikarp kind of goes darker there. And then we move on to the Brown Tiger. The Brown ze Wait, what? The Brown Zebra? No, wait, where's the Brown Zebra? Where's the Brown Zebra? The Brown Zebra is gone. Guys, there it is, right there. Okay, so the brown zebra, then the uh, cal calico. Is that how you say it? Calico? Calico. There you go. Calico, orange, and gold. And this is definitely my favorite because, as you can tell, guys, it has stars, I think, on it. I think it has stars anyway. They look like stars, so they're not. I'm, I feel kind of silly. Uh, but either way, that looks very awesome, too. Moving on to the next one, we have the white uh, variant of that, too. And then we also have the black variant of it also. Now this one is very cool too. This is a Calico white and orange. And it's kind of like all over Magikarp's face. It's all like white and whatever. So yeah, that, that looks very cool too. I love that one. Moving on, these are definitely what people are going to be going for. These are probably most likely going to be the rarest because... Um, whether or not, like, what Gyarados looks like, you know, we, we don't know what Gyarados is going to look like with these on, but what you see on screen right now is the grey bubbled Mari Magikarp, and that looks amazing. To me, that is really, really awesome. Then we also have the grey diamonds, and then also the grey patches. They just call it the grey patches. Uh, patches. Then we move on, we also have, uh, let's see, the orange da dapples. Yeah, the orange dapples. The orange orca, a uh, orange two-tone, which kind of looks a bit meh, if I'm honest. It doesn't look really that great. It just looks like a regular Magikarp. And then we move on to the pink dapples. Yes, pink Magikarp guys are going to be in the game. Uh, so there's the pink dapples. We have the pink orca. We have the pink two-tone. And then we also have uh, purple bubbles, purple diamonds, purple patches. And last but not least, I think it's called Skelly, which is like, it kind of has the outer, like the pattern looks like it's a fish kind of skeleton, you know what I mean? Either way, all of those look amazing. I'm sorry for brain farting there, but I had to say like so many very quickly together. Either way, they all look so, so good in the Magikarp jump game. Whether or not they look good in the Pokemon Brick Bronze game, you know, whether or not we'll actually be able to tell the detail on the actual things, I don't know. But I genuinely have faith in the team, and I think that Shypool has definitely done a great job on the existing, uh, kind of like, you know, kind of, um, skin, kind of thing? <laughs> I don't know how you say it. Uh, but either way, it looks great. I'm looking at the, the, the clip right now, and it looks really good. It looks so good, in fact. That uh, I definitely cannot wait for this next update. Uh, now, for a lot of you who have been asking, when do you, do I think the next update is coming out? Um, we do have word that Lando thinks it'll be out either next week or the week after. So, around about that time frame. If you have something planned for next week or the week after, I would kind of just suggest try and not have anything planned. <laughs> if you want to get, like, the first kind of uh, videos out or, you know, kind of whatever else, you know? Um, well, anyway, yeah, tell me, guys, what your favorite patched or kind of patterned Magikarp is, and if you cannot wait to see it in the game. Personally, I'm torn between the gray bubbles and the pink dapples. I don't really know yet. They look amazing, though. I really want a pink Magikarp. I really want a pink Magikarp, because the shiny version of it will be blue, maybe, if they decide to do that. I don't know. Um, whether or not we'll have to pay for these, we don't really know. But, yeah, still, could be very cool. Could be very, very cool indeed. Before we end today's video, guys, I also want to announce that my new Discord server, which has been kind of polished and smoothed out, is now back up in line for the public. So if you guys want to join and talk to me and kind of make the community a nicer place and kind of contribute, then feel free to actually go to the description, the description, and uh, yeah, the link to my Discord will be there. Just kind of join it and uh, sign up and uh, start talking to me, my moderators, my 
group, I guess, my Discord. And uh, yeah, please help me make it a nice, awesome place. Uh, but anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. Please do give what your uh, opinions on this update is. Like, do what? What are your what are your hopes for this update? Do you hope that it's going to be free? And what are your favorite patterns on the Magikarp? Uh, well, anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see you.